if we weren't focusing on simply pushing all the cuts on the backs of the poor and the working class. We need to have our legislators find other ways to address this crisis. One of, and one of the most important things they can do is listen to people like you and you and you and me. We are the backbone of this nation. The working people are the backbone of this nation. This thousands and thousands of Amer uh, Ohioans have already lost their jobs. And with this budget cut, more are going to lose their jobs. You think we have an outstanding school system now? Well, what is it going to be like with this new budget cut? It's all going to be even poorer. People are going to be poorer. Our health system is going to be poorer. Our, our, edu our education system is not going to be this poorer. It's probably going to be the poorest that has ever been in the history of this country. And we can overturn this. We can speak out now and say, if you pass that budget today, it's not going to stay that way. Are we right? So what we're going to do is we're going to go over to Barton Station. We're going to hear more and more about your issues. We're going to see a graveyard that is a witness for all the things that we and our forefathers have worked hard for, have died for, that are going to be dead and buried if we don't let these things go now. If we let these things go now. And we're not going to let that happen.